Well, we have this Oprah crew. Apparently she's some famous talk show host. No, it's really exciting. Arriving to work was like being one of the real housewives. Hi. It's like Sleepy Hollow out here. It's so foggy. <laughs> Who wore their bright shoelaces? Normally, I don't let people see me before I put my makeup on in the morning. I think we timed the arrivals perfectly to make sure everyone know we don't actually sleep in the same dwelling. <laughs> Redheads first. And they got footage of Eric getting his hair done, which is a 20 minute process. It's gonna be very boring footage. <laughs> Lots of blow drying of hair. No talking. And it's a little bit of pressure to be on at 6.30 in the morning. But I'm doing it for y'all. Made my coffee. Plug out to Intelligence. Yeah, you probably can't show that. Um, so, you know, I'm gonna put my, oh, I think we're doing a rehearsal. I'm gonna go take my iPad out of my Prius and put it in my star wagon. It's because that's what it's called. It's not because I'm calling myself a star. No. Is breakfast here? Oh, I That's what's next. Nice. Oh. This is our new craft service area. I usually go for a real big giant bowl of eggs. Hey, this is Michael Spiller, our director. Look who it is. Who it is. He's having bacon. Sorry. There's some other stuff. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Excuse me. Yeah. He's having the bacon breakfast. The bacon is so good. Root, the commissary root. makes it. Every everyone makes it up there. Are the guys? And it's always so good and crispy. Everyone likes crispy bacon. Yeah. Oprah Winfrey has sent not only a documentary crew to document our day's work, but then another crew documenting them, documenting us. And now I'm talking to you, and you're documenting them, documenting, documenting us. Okay, we got it. You know she's a huge fan of the show. Um, yeah. Are you surprised by that? Well, Oprah's cool. We're cool, so I'm, I guess I wouldn't be too surprised. As busy as she is, I can't imagine how she picks and chooses, you know, what she watches. So just that alone, the fact that we're something she makes time for is really great. We're happy that uh, she's watching the show or seeing the show and, like, wants to uh, make us a part of that. Can't wait to, to experience uh, that via, I think we're going to be via satellite, right? Yes. We're very flattered that she likes the show and her her uh, producers like our show. I was just watching happily as uh, our cast was being interviewed, and at the end of it, she called me out. She did that uh, voice that she does, Steve Levitan, which is just strange when you hear your name said that way by Oprah. I know you know the cast felt that way too, and then suddenly there I am on the couch talking to Oprah. It was fantastic, and I know a lot of people saw it. The word of Oprah is is really powerful, and that means a lot, because we are proud of the show, and it's it means something that she she likes it. I mean, you know, her time has to be so restricted that for her to make time to watch our show is it's really cool, Jesse, really humbling. That was really fun. Hey, it was great to see them, you on the show. Just tell now. them what, what you guys think. We're Twittering about it. How do you spell that over Winfrey? No, you can't Twitter about it, Jesse. We're under strict restrictions.